All right, I have no idea how loud this is. Good. Um, I love how the only text you can read on that screen is warning and stop, which is basically everything you need to know about playing Biocom Arcade. <laughs> yeah, that's it. All right, probably uh, a little quieter. I don't think I have any volume through, unless there's no demo sound. There is no demo sound. Yeah, just, just so the fan. We just have started. to make a guess here for how loud this is going to be. Good. Uh, actually, this is pretty good. All right, so there's exactly one pattern at the beginning here that will kill me. So I'm looking forward to getting it. Yep. <laughs> there are three guys here! Holy shit! <laughs> no? <laughs> wow. Get fucking shown. Dude. We're gonna... <laughs> Get <laughs> fucking <laughs> shown. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and restart this one. You... <laughs> You got yours. <laughs> Literally never in my life have I seen three. <laughs> now there are exactly two patterns that can kill me. What the fuck? <laughs> this game is <laughs> absolutely dunked on. This game is amazing. Look at that, there's only one guy here now. <laughs> Holy shit. Never, never have I seen three guys. I'm surprised, I'm surprised you agreed to play this game. I love this game. I think yeah. this game is a riot. <laughs> it's, it's, just, <laughs> it's just an asshole. <laughs> yeah. I mean, this game is neat. It's just, it, it's a lot like 2K9. It's super neat until you try to play it with the timer going. Oh my god. <clears throat> that said, this is one of those games that I am very... If if you ask me to bet money on a speed run that's never getting beat, this is one I would put up. Yeah, that run because, that I got is pretty damn good. Yeah, one, it's pretty damn good, and two, someone that would have to A, buy a Biocom board with proper hardware, and B, be willing to try and beat that. Uh, I mean, they could use the ports. They have problems, but there are ports. Hell, they might be faster because they don't lag. Well, I assume they well, don't lag. Well, if we live in the speedrun.com world, then that's valid as hell, isn't it? I mean, double emulated. Right. This is a problem. Oh, wow, you are... Whoops. I didn't have any option there. Um, so that the guy with the bayonet is not supposed to ever be able to walk to the right, and he walked to the right. Um, nice. But it's something that's happened, like, it's something that never ever happened during routing, and then happened a few times during my last day of attempts. So I'm not sure what part of my approach is wrong there, because it's definitely something, um, there's something that I'm doing wrong that causes it. I'm not just not sure what it is. So when he does that, I just have no idea how to adjust. Um, if you drop back down, it screws up your manipulation for everything else. And that's generally worse than just hoping that it doesn't happen. Uh, Alright. So this is significantly more difficult when you don't have the bionic arm supercharger. All right, what drop do we get? Cigarettes. Oh boy. <coughs> what did the cigarettes do? Points. Everything is just points. Everything is points. They make their health go down. <laughs> like in Metal Gear. Um, I need this guy to <laughs> jump at me. That works also. Yeah, all the, all the drops that randomly spawn are uh, just points. Um, the... The weapons and the Bionic Arm uh, Supercharger are all systematic drops. I know exactly where they're going to spawn. Like that, uh... I got punched by nothing! Huh. This wow. isn't even going to be a loop 1 1 CC. That's a safe space to stall. Wow. Final uh, Combat Arcade is playing well. Yeah, it is! Holy shit! What the... 
Wow. <laughs> Guy just got all the mech and jumped right into a pit. Nice! I got the best end pose. Holy shit, what did you do? I, yes. I fixed Super Joe. This is what you get for your future crimes, Joe. <laughs> That's what happens when you land on your head. Don't do drugs. Don't do drugs. You certainly do whatever drugs it is that he found. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Murph. Way to be a good example for the kids. Do yeah, as many buddy. drugs as you want, as long as it's not his. Alright, so... Um, even though I have that bionic arm turbocharger, I'm gonna take the same approach that I would normally take if I did elevator skip. Because it's slightly... There's an extra helicopter here. <laughs> What's the turbocharger do? I forget. I uh, just... It extends and pulls in the grapple quicker. So you can climb quicker, you can poke things quicker. It's pretty critical if you plan to do anything with any kind of speed. This also has the longest bionic, like, longest grapple in any of the games, right? Yeah, it's like full screen height. Yeah. There's something wrong with the sound channels because it sounds like it's only coming through one channel. Oh, that'll all be oh, fine, actually. It sounds pretty normal on my end. I can't. Fish is our TMP. Great stage. Alright, good. Yeah, that was super nice. The game let you play the game for a stage. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that setup's pretty good. There's just a, there are a few combinations of patterns that uh, you can't really do with that approach, but they're pretty rare. One complete, and we got the extra life, so that's that's nice. Nicely done. All right, so did you just kill his doppelganger? Yeah, I did. He escapes. Uh oh, he leaves uh he leaves the dummy behind to take the fall. The game expects that you're slow enough that he's just kind of gone by the time you get up here, and then the doppelganger is the one that you kill. Oh. But you can you can beat that guy to the top. Um, you can't beat the general. general, you can't do anything to him. Well, you can do things to him. You can knock him off the elevator, and then he walks through the wall and takes a new elevator up into the clouds, and is just gone. <laughs> he, like, he super escapes. I remember that. <laughs> super escapes. Like, I have a video of that on YouTube, and it's pretty hilarious. <laughs> Alright, so Loop 2 is, um, it's not too, too much different uh, for most of these normal stages. It's just that there are more enemies, um, and some of the enemies are slightly more aggressive. It's, it really becomes a problem in stages 4 and 5 with the helicopters, because it spawns 2 instead of 1, and the helicopters are assholes. One of the most entertaining things I've ever seen was watching Ron Scott try to get through this. Yeah, this game, if you have no plan going in, is just so, so angry. Yeah, I know. I remember when I got, I don't know, I think it was one of the Capcom Classics collections on PS2. I'm like, oh, sick, Bionic Commando, and I'm like, oh, it's the arcade version. Alright, that's cool. Yeah, I didn't make it through the first stage. Yeah. 
a respectable showing. <laughs> yeah, right. It's one of the games where like no amount of reflexes is going to save you your first time playing it. No. Yeah. No, because like you just have to like if you just choose something that's wrong. Not that you have any indication that it could be wrong. If it happens to be wrong, then you're gonna die. It's it's kind of like playing chess, except your opponent gets to move four pieces for each of your one. <laughs> right. So, if you make one move, it's not like you lose a piece. It's like, you lose the piece and then the entire game is over. <laughs> Put in another quarter and try again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My plan is don't play. That's the right plan. Yeah, no, that's the proper approach. It's a good one. The first step to playing Bionic Commando Arcade is to play something else. I thought I was gonna die to that green lizard, I'm not gonna lie. Holy shit. Hey, we got the cigarettes again. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit! <laughs> Alright, well, we only died once. We almost made it out, but I I got juked. <coughs> Don't you dare! Oh my god. So this section's tough because uh, the enemies fall. I love it. I love it. I love it. They reach terminal velocity like instantly. Okay, so you can't really react to them falling uh, because by the time they're on screen, they're already moving at max velocity, and you can't uh, can't get out of the way. All right, so one spare life. Stage four, hardest stage in the game. <laughs> Should be fine. Yeah. And what you're not seeing in this run is that for the actual speed run that PJ did of this game, you can take no unintentional deaths because of a massive skip he has to do. Yeah. So you can skip this helicopter, but it requires four deaths. Or this helicopter, this elevator, rather. Yep. Oh boy, this is gonna be. This is gonna be interesting. Interesting situation. Uh, I would like them to not be here. Alright, so that guy's getting scared away. He should have been getting scared away. Nice. So when you're down here, the helicopters won't, uh... HOLY SHIT! Wow. Uh, so that is exactly wow. the wrong spot. Uh, that enemy is 100% uh, impossible to, uh, to dodge when he's in that position. Hmm. Hmm. And then the Fuck, man, that's so unlucky. Wow. That's so unlucky. I needed, I, I manipulated the helicopters right, but I needed them to not, uh, not drop down. And dropping down is their rarest their rarest action, so it's really not even that that big of a... I had no play there. So this is a problem. This is what happens when you when you lose control of a situation in this game. Right. Oh god. I oh lost god. control. That's about right. That's, that's what happens. <laughs> Fuck, man. Game. Yeah. Wow. That up nonsense. Oof. 
<laughs> Thanks for the cheer, A. Hey, McFarlane. Yeah, it's, uh, it's really unfortunate. I had really good spacing there, but... What can you do? What can you do? Alright, so there is one more, uh, turbocharger that I can get, and I get it by just doing a basic... A basic swing at the start. This is, uh... Okay. There is an extra mech here! Was like the optimal place to die if you're going to die. All right, well, three credit. Oof. Yeah, that was uh, that was interesting. One of the generals that was supposed to be there in the that intermediate section in this stage was a mech instead, and the mech jumped into me. Oh, that's. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, that's a bit of a problem. It's a minor problem. I fulfilled so I like my duty. I like how it says you have other missions to complete and there's only one. Yeah, yeah. No one wants a loop three of this game. Helicopters are in every stage. <laughs> Bees are just... <laughs> Bees are just chasing you through stage four. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Insert your name theme is so cheery too. I know. I I love the music in this game. It's pretty great. It it's a really weird sound font at first, but like once you've kind of once you've kind of gotten over that, it's super good. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. So, I think, unfortunately for you guys, I don't think I'm going to be able to stream Rearm 2 with just game audio. Okay. So you get nothing. Cool. But, uh... uh... <laughs> Alright. You lose. You well, nothing. good time is any to get a new drink, then. Oh, you're right. Make me one? Uh... Sure, and then I'm gonna drink it. Okay. That's right. Do you like the lemon juice? Okay, arcade. You get turned off. Uh oh shit. I need this monitor, don't I? Like in general or to play the game? Uh to play the game. <laughs> Let's see. Oh god, there's a new comment here. Okay, I, oh wait, that's not a new comment. That's a notification. Dang, I was hoping it was a... Some fan mail to read. Alright, let's see here. DLC widescreen. Amarak is not here. God, just a giant smug ass. <laughs> 